Goodale and he's from Blackpool Markets here. Joe Biden seen as the new president-elect for 2020. Really interesting to see now what, how the US dollar reacts in an FX markets that remain so uncertain, especially in a climate of rock bottom interest rates around the global sphere. Now, what we saw ever since the election results started to come out is that the US dollar remained extremely volatile. In fact, extending a move to the downside, going to those yearly lows on the dollar index around the 92.10 dollar cent dollar mark. Now, that again was a key support level that saw a rebound um, a few weeks ago back up to the $94 mark however that couldn't sustain buyers couldn't hold up that rally um, of course this year has turned extremely bearish from that $100 mark but this is a chart going all the way back to 2014 and what we can see is the dollar index beginning to enter a key support area that's been playing on the dollar index as, as a support zone ever since 2015 we've rejected already once or twice this year uh, we could continue to see a rejection, however, the likelihood is that the dollar could remain weak and it could continue to slide lower during a Biden term chip. So, what we could see as targets to the downside in the dollar index are this 90 mark as your first point and then $88 mark, uh, the $88 mark if it does continue to slide lower. Why would it slide well, like I said, with interest rates remaining at rock bottom, uh, aside from that 2.5%, 2%, what we saw during the, the golden era of the dollar, as you were, the latter stages of Trump's term, pre-pandemic, of course, more stimulus expected, um, essentially devalue the US dollar, making it, of course, more competitive for international trade with more of the G, most of the G7 currencies being more aligned, taking away from that disparity between the dollar strength against its counterparts, as we saw 2014, we could, that $80 mark is definitely not off the table. So this dollar slide could well be on. We could see it accelerate, especially as we're expecting to see these rock bottom interest rates from the Federal Reserve for the next uh, two or three years. So do keep your eyes on the dollar index chart. This will strongly determine money flow in the markets, especially when it comes to stocks, when it comes to commodities, and when it comes to the FX markets, of course. So, dollar index is your determining factor. What's going to determine it? Well, it's, of course, eyes will turn to Joe Biden's trade policies, of course, but there's nothing you can do, he can do about the, the fiscal side of things, uh, the monetary policy, uh, that will continue to stay low interest rates, quantitative easing will continue over the next year as well as the economy tries to fight its way as fast as possible back from this recession. So do stay tuned, do trade safe. If you're trading the FX markets, this is something you need to be following. All the best.